In this video, we are going to see how to post on Twitter the same content posted on Facebook. So you want that every time a new post is posted on Facebook, the same post should be tweeted on Twitter. Now how can that be done? For this, some integration has to be made between the two applications and the same thing can be done using Public Connect software. Here your trigger application would be Facebook and your action application would be Twitter. Now how can you do this yourself? Integrate and automate this entire process. To understand that, let me take you to my screen. To begin with the process, we are first going to type the URL pabli.com slash connect and as we do that, here we have reached the landing page of this software. On the right hand side, we can see two options, sign in and sign up for free. So if you are an existing user, just click on sign in. If you are a new user, click on this tab sign up. It won't take more than two minutes and also at the time of account creation, you will get 100 free tasks. So now I'm going to click on sign in as I'm an existing user here. And here we have reached all applications page. Let's click on access now for Pabli Connect. As we do that, here we have reached the dashboard of this application. Again, on the right hand side, you can see a tab create workflow. Let's click on this. And as we do that, a dialog box has appeared, which is asking us to name this workflow. Now here, my objective is that every time a post is posted on Facebook, then automatically the same content should be tweeted on Twitter. So I'm going to name it as post on Twitter, the same content posted on Facebook. Let's click on create. As we do that here, we have reached another window which has got two extremely important events. One is trigger, another one is action. Triggers and actions are basically those two principles or concepts on which this entire automation works. Trigger is when this happens, action says do this. Basically action here is the response of your trigger application. Now, according to this integration, my trigger application would be Facebook. So I'm going to click on Facebook pages. Now the trigger event. So this is the event that will make this workflow run. So it would be new post. Now on the right hand side, it is written that this trigger will check for new data in every 10 minutes, which basically means that this trigger application has a polling time of 10 minutes. That says that this workflow is going to run in every 10 minutes to fetch for new data. Now I'm going to click on connect. As I do that, Public Connect is asking to connect itself with the Facebook Pages account. I'm going to click on Add New Connection and then Connect with Facebook Pages. As I do that, since I've already logged into my Facebook account, it is asking me to continue. And here we can see that the authorization has been successful. Now here we have to mention the name of the page and the number of posts. So now first I'm going to take you to my Facebook account and these are the various pages that I have already created. So let's say that I want a post to be posted on this particular page. The name is Ayush Herbal Stool. So now I'm going to go back to Pabli Connect and here I'm going to select the post which is Ayush Herbal Stool. Now the number of posts. So basically, in every request, how many posts do you want to be retrieved? So here, I'm going to just take an example. This is just a test case. So I'm just going to write one and then click on save and send test request. So here we can see that we have received the API response and, and in this response, we have received the last post that was posted on Facebook. So let me show you the post here. Let me take you to the page. So I'm going to go to Ayush Herbal. As I click on create post, so it is going to switch me to the page. And now as I take you down, so I'm just going to close this. And as I take you down, so here, this was the last post, new product launch, herbal conditioning shampoo, and this was the image. And as I take you here, so here you can see that this was the same message that was posted, right? And then again, we have here the name. Ayush Herbal Store. This is again the description. And then as I take you down here, we have the link, the URL. So now what is my objective? Here my objective is that every time a post is posted on Facebook, then automatically it should be posted on Twitter. So I'm going to choose my action application as Twitter. Let's click on this. And the action event here would be connect tweet with media. Let's click on connect. So here Public Connect is asking to connect itself with a Twitter account. I'm going to click on add new connection, connect with Twitter. I have already logged into my Twitter account. So it is asking me to access the account. I'm going to authorize the app 
and then you can see here that it has been authorized once this is done here we have to enter the message so what is my tweet so i'm going to go down this here should be my tweet and then this is my message now the media file url so so here again i'm going to click on this go to the previous step and then for the url as i take you down so here this is the picture url and then the media category it is an image i'm going to click on save and send test request and here we can see that we have received the api response which basically says that now this post should be posted on twitter let me take you to my twitter account and now i'm going to arshiz rai and i'm going to the home page once again and this here is my twitter account where the tweet has been posted which basically means that this integration isn't complete success but we also need to check this in real so what i'm going to do i'm going to go back to facebook and here i'm going to create another post so let's say here i'm going to post new offer get free sun cap with herbal products okay and now i'm going to add an image over here let's click on this and i'm going to go to pictures and this is the sun cap that i'm offering let's click on post and here you can see that this particular post has been posted which basically means that now this should also be posted on twitter so as i take you to public connect here it is written that we have got a polling time of 10 minutes so now we are supposed to wait for 10 minutes so that the same post can be posted on twitter so it's been 10 minutes and now i'm going to take you back to twitter i'm going to refresh this page quickly and as i do that here we can see that yes our post has been tweeted which basically means that this integration process is a complete success now i'm going to take you back to public connect to understand what we have done so here our trigger application was facebook pages where the event was new post and our action application was twitter where the event was create tweet with media i hope this is absolutely clear to you if, if in case you have any issues you can refer to the workflow which is given in the video description you can also clone the same and start to process immediately apart from this if you have any particular integration to work on you can always write to us not only this but you can integrate multiple applications using public connect software to ask any of your query you have to write at forum.pabli.com you can also visit our website which is www.pabli.com/connect to get all the details about the latest updates the integrations and applications you can visit our facebook group if in case you have found this video helpful then do not forget to share this with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get into automation and make their life easy i'm going to see you very soon with different integrations and automations do not forget to like share and subscribe take care of yourself